Hey guys, Buddy Love here with another Ultimate Team Player Review. This week I'll be doing Team of the Season Patrick Herman from Borussia Mönchengladbach in the Bundesliga. I played Herman in a 4 3 2 1 formation mixed with Bundesliga and Serie A. I tried second in form Aubameyang and Lewandowski up front, but to be honest, I didn't like either, so a lot of the time I was just subbing on Ronaldo off the bench to play at striker. Now when I click on Herman's card, it says I played 16 games and scored 11 goals with him. But that's not true, I actually played 8 games and scored 9 goals, while only registering the 1 assist, which I find strange because he does have great passing and crossing stats. He cost me 80k and for a team with a season card, I felt like that was a reasonable price and well affordable for most people. Now onto his in-game stats. The stats I want to highlight are, well, where do I start? 97 acceleration, 99 agility, 95 balance, 99 sprint speed, 90 dribbling, and 86 ball control. Wow. To me, this guy is up there with one of the best wingmen in the game. He reminded me a lot of Quadrado, just without the skill moves, as he only had 3 star skills. Now let's look at how those stats reflect in game. His pace was unreal. At no point in the game did I feel like I couldn't get past a certain defender and at no point did I ever look like getting caught once I was on a break. His speed caused so much trouble for my opposition and it has to be by far his best stat. But with the base stat of 98, this should be pretty obvious. So if you're looking for a pace hungry winger, Herman is your guy. Now his dribbling, which felt great. It was a massive upgrade from his previous cards and I think um, is the reason why this card feels so much better than his previous cards. Yes, the pace upgrade was great, but the fact that he is now agile enough to weave in and around players makes him deadly. He can now speed dribble a lot better too, and the fact that he has 97 acceleration and 99 sprint speed means that once he, he speed dribbles past one of the opposition defenders, he's basically through on goal. On to his shooting which I felt was pretty damn good. I could really feel the 86 shot power and 83 long shots, as I could blast awesome shots across goal, which I noticed isn't too common in this FIFA. I also think that 9 goals in 8 games is a pretty good return. So a pretty solid shooter, if you wanted to play in, in the right forward position like I did. So on to his passing. This was an attribute I couldn't really fault him on, but for some reason I only managed the 1 assist with him, which I felt was weird. After a few games with him, I started to try and cross more with him because, you know, he had 88 crossing and 88 curve, but I felt like for some reason his crosses weren't that great, and the ones that were good didn't have enough power on them as my striker managed to get ahead to them, but they were easily saved by the goalkeeper. Now he's physical. He obviously isn't that strong with only 62 strength, but having 99 balance sure does help, as most of the time I felt like I did get knocked off the ball by a strong centre back, but I could easily go shoulder to shoulder with, with wing backs, and use my pace to outrun them, as my balance would help me hold them off. Another physical stat that was surprising was 95 jumping, but in the 8 games I played with him, I didn't really get into much aerial duels with him, so I couldn't really test it out. Now onto his pros and cons. His pros were his pace, his dribbling which was a massive upgrade, his shot power and his finishing. His cons had to be um, the Bundesliga strikers I didn't really like so that had to be a con. Um, 3 star skills, his strength and also his positioning. Sometimes he sat a bit too far back when I was on the attack and I, I felt like that was because his original position was right mid and he did want to stay back a bit so he loses points for that. So my overall love rating for Herman is 7.5 out of 10, who for me felt like the German Quadrado, just a little bit more expensive. So thanks for watching, if you liked the review, please like, subscribe, and stay classy, thank you.